what is up guys it has been a while since um i posted anything um i just wanted to like because i don't have the community tab yet at all um far from it but i just wanted to go ahead and say that you know i'm, I'm sorry that i haven't been present at all um and uh and yeah, no, like I, I posted a comment, pretty much the, the comment, if you didn't see the comment um, at all, then it pretty much said that school's been a, a little bit of a, a, a little bit, a little bit much. It's, it's been hectic, not gonna lie. Um, but not only that, but um, personal life wise, um, I got a cat. Well, yeah, yeah, I got a cat. Um, so if you, if you guys can hear like the bell or she's meowing anywhere then yeah then you guys will know that it's her um so you guys don't need to be asking but yeah i got i got a cat her name's winry um adopted her actually from the from the shelter um but yeah so her name was winry and we just kind of didn't change it at all um so it just kind of stuck so no it, it's not a full metal alchemist thing yeah, I'm just playing with uh with the little coin here. Not yet opening. Which opening is either gonna be this, this, or this? <laughs> I know, right? I, I give I give the great names of like the products out. Cause somebody said they want to see the Charizard Hidden Fates tin, and they were like, "Dude, it's gonna it's gonna you know get you up there. It's gonna <laughs> like rocket ship you." Um, but. I was just kind of thinking about it and just kind of like, mm, I don't know. It, it's got Charizard. I mean, I, I could clickbait it if I really wanted to, but probably not going to. Like I said, it's, it's Charizard Hidden Fates, but I like it so much just sealed, so that may stay. It might be, though, like since I did say I didn't want to um, deal with like this Vanguard playmat anymore, I might actually go into the Champion's Path today but like i said i just wanted to update you guys on that so well on that portion there's still more poor so college has just been crazy it, it's been ridiculous when one of the teachers said i was i was being a little rude in one of my papers so uh, so i had to email her and let her know like i because i personally didn't understand how i was being rude at all like mm, it's a it, it's a pretty touchy class so if you guys are curious what class and it's diversity and it's just it, i don't know I, I feel like more so like if you go into a diversity class or even if you're teaching a diversity class then you shouldn't you know disregard anybody's opinion as long as they like answer the question like you know but i mean hey it's it's uh 2021 um some things i guess can't be can't be taken appropriately or said at all um so that's that uh like right now i actually like like i chose this over watching um wwe extreme rules right now which i mean i just kind of would leave it on in the background i really don't care too much for it i got like peacock to watch SummerSlam for uh for john cena because uh, honestly i'm a big john cena fanboy but uh besides that though um so so it's been a little bit of like a roller coaster this week um not gonna lie um i i will say that that i don't know what what the future holds for me um so i had to check on the cat she's just over here licking herself taking a bath but um i don't know what the future holds for me entirely i'm not dying um not not in any of that it's just this backdrop here like this um could be different um in like weeks days maybe even months don't know yet um but, uh, but yeah, I, I, I'll go ahead and just come out with it. Um, me and who I was in a relationship with, we just recently broke up. 
So that's been, you know, the reason as to why, as well as to why I haven't uploaded anything. Um, I just, I don't know. I, I haven't really felt like wanting to upload anything. And I don't know. It, it, it's stupid to say because... Because more so, I, I was, uh, I was the one who initiated the breakup. Um, we're we're still in we're in civil terms, but I was the one who initiated the breakup. Which I mean, hey, when this is your second relationship, um, you don't, you don't think too much of how you're gonna, about how you're gonna feel being the per the. The breaker upper, I guess, if that's how you want to properly call it. Um, you you just don't know how how you're gonna like feel, and uh, apparently I, I'm I'm not taking it well at all. I had well, I haven't taken it well at all. I thought it honestly would have been a lot easier, but it has not. Um, so just I don't know. I don't know. Well, like I said, it, it it's it's kind of what you know, like. It was just like like you lose interest in someone and um and you just don't but it it, it still sucks you know um so that's that um but other than that then yeah it's pretty much been it. it's just been you know kind of working along like I said no new product I haven't gotten any new product I haven't bought anything new um as well, just because, you know, adulting and, and bills. And so that kind of ends up taking over. Um, as well as there hasn't been really anything too great. Don't worry, Alec. I haven't forgotten you about Yu-Gi-Oh. Um, like, I was originally going to do that, but I decided to be a little bit irresponsible. I guess. <laughs> or a little bit selfish compared to, like, compared to the channel itself. And, um... And by a pair of hey dudes, which like I'm, I'm just telling you guys, if you guys have not worn them, they are literally the comfiest shoe out there. <laughs> They're so comfy. Um, so yeah, I, I bought a pair of those. I splurged a little, and I bought a, a hoodie as well. Since and they, up here in like the Midwest, I don't know what it is with like stores and stuff in like the Midwest. They just like rotate their like inventory so fast, like their seasonal inventory. So like. So, like, it'll be, like, middle of summer. They will drop, like, the really nice-looking hoodies. Like, if you've ever gone shopping, you, you know what I'm talking about. Like, you know they drop the good stuff, like, during the end of summer where no one's really buying them. You know, people will pick and, you know, grab here and there, maybe, like, one, two. And then, like, fall hits, and then they just come out with these, like, ugly, like, looking stuff. Like, I hate it when, like when like the season hits and they just come out with like the ugliest looking like wardrobe that you can get so so i don't know but yeah um well like i said i'm I'm doing fine in that way um but yeah just kind of doing that and i was just like you know what i owe you guys a video don't know if you guys heard the ac kick on but i was like I, you know what i definitely owe you guys a video um, and I think I just kind of made up my mind just because like I've left you guys for so long and some of you guys could have honestly unsubscribed really, um, gonna move that there for now, but, uh, but I decided, you, you know, our goal was 10, I'd say eight's good enough since I've left you with like either one week or two with no video. So we're going to do it. The grand daddy of them all right here champions path premium collection marnie box um so yeah this is this is really happening it's there it goes all the value that this box held gone um but yeah like i said that, that's been that so Oh, I actually should have flipped it. If you guys do ever like get a hold of like one of these or anything, you you get like a yeah right right there. Um, foil card, two foil cards, two collectors pins, and an awesome TCG play map featuring Marnie, eight TCG booster packs, and a code. So, oh, 
And you know what, dude? We're, 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 let's go ahead. If you guys are not subscribed, let's go ahead and show that guy <laughs> that uh that you know the the premium Marnie box. And, hey, you knocked that <laughs> off. <laughs> but the premium Marnie box is going to um it's going to bring in the the view count and the uh, subs and all that. So look at that. It, it come. Jeez, that is heavy. I forgot there's a man in there. I'm probably still gonna keep like the empty box and all. I don't know. Maybe all pink. <laughs> Cat scared. Um, but yeah, I've I've actually been like waiting for so long to open this. But going back to that. Um, Back to you, Alec. Um, don't worry, Yu-Gi-Oh will be coming. Coming. I, I know I keep saying that, but trust me. All right, trust me. Have faith. <laughs> Have faith. I uh, I'm planning on picking up some of them ancient battle tins, one or two, depends if if I can even find them. But yeah, there's your two foils. We're gonna have to try and beat, you know two two basic foils that are guaranteed I, I don't know what to oh, shoot I was like I don't know what I do with my sleeves I'm gonna put this more Pico V and one I know right it's so interesting just get with the pack opening. This is gonna be a long video. I already know it. I already know it's gonna be a long one. So play mat. We're just gonna set that. That's all we do with it. That's how the play mat stays. I'm sorry for them ear earbud users. Oh look at that! That you see that the packs taped down like that. You, you definitely know someone's rigged them. I'm just playing. But here's that code card for y'all. I don't know what that's going to give you guys. Probably like sleeves or something. I don't know. Like I was even kind of thinking about like, what if I did, you know, Beyblade? I don't know. Oh, gosh. I'm trying to hold up, hold up. Now I had to get the other, the other pin, the more Pico pin. Oh, I don't know if I even put my face. I don't think I put my face on the camera. I don't know. <laughs> I'm so self-conscious about that. But um, so here is Mr. More Pico, all angry, nice looking, and then here's Grim Snarl. Very nice, very nice. All right, so you get both of those. Like I said, if you, if you can pick this up, you get, you get a good chunk of stuff. So here we got our eight champions path packs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You know, I wish, I wish Pokemon did this more often. Like they, they released like those instead of like ebt's not not gonna lie um just, just because like i mean um, or like they release these like a little bit more frequently just because like the play mat like like we're gonna have to do a change scenery but the play mat is just like they should know that you need to protect your cards i need to do move all of this All of this out of the way. I know you guys are just like just open up the damn packs. I don't care about no no damn play mat. But if you do, there it is. The Marnie Champions Path play mat, which very nice. Very, very nice. I'm gonna go ahead and just set that up like so. Oh move the camera a little bit and the tripod. So there's that now. So now we got we got an official Pokemon backdrop. Don't worry, I'll end up fixing like the, the bottom stand. But yeah, 
Like I said, I think looks very nice. Put our backdrop, our new back display now back there. So we're gonna get eight packs. You got eight packs right here. Four, eight. Yep, I can do math. Let's go. Eight packs. First pack, we're gonna we're gonna do a I don't even know who you are. Also, the other reason why I haven't opened up that Shining Fates is I'm, I'm debating. Do I want to keep it? No, no. I want to open it up, but I'm debating if I want to um, uh, just go ahead and, and there's the code for y'all. If I just want to go ahead and I don't know. I kind of lost my train of thought. Oh. Like, I will, like, I want to open it, but, like, I don't know. I've just been so burnt out of, like, Shining Fates. Like, I hate seeing Shining Fates at the stores. <laughs> I hate it. So, we're going to start off with the Psychic Energy. Uh-huh. But, yeah, that's also the reason why I'm opening this instead of because I'm, like, so much Shining Fates. So much has been opened up. And it's, like, I'm pretty sure everyone's tired of it. But Celebrations, I believe, is just right around the corner here. We got Rock Roof. Got a Vulpix, very nice. We're gonna get a potion. Start off with a Milo reverse. Oh, and we're gonna get a hollow Zygarde. All right. So that's not, I actually need to put my two promos back there. Ooh. Let's drop them. But yeah, the, I'll take the Zygarde. Take the Zygarde, but it doesn't count towards the points. So far, promos are like the only, the only good card we've got. <laughs> terrible to say that but anything great here i like the vulpix i like how that looks so i'll definitely put vulpix aside but anybody else in there don't really care about pack number two work has been great i guess um so yeah Lost the, uh, no longer with the woman, but I guess acquired a, uh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Video's already depressing, god damn it. No, but there's a code card. Hopefully we can liven up the, uh, the mood here. Come on. Let's go. Unlisted leaf energy. What are you doing? I don't know if you heard her, but does anybody else's cat just like scratch at like the freaking like their own reflection? Oh, we got an Apsil. All right, all right. I see you, Apsil. I don't know if there's a V Max. I, I, I swear there probably is. We got a Trubbish looking all happy. We got a Roly Coley. We got a Galarian Zigzagoon. We got a Weedle. We got a Slizipede. I hate this card so much. And wow, another Zygarde. Oh my god. Wow. Two for two Zygards. I just need 98 more Zygards. And then I got. No, technically, I'd only need 49 more, 48 more Zygards. And then I got Zygarde. But yeah, if you hear her in the background, it's because um she her story is she it was actually locked in the basement. Um, actually, let's go ahead and open up that that last cream puff. These cream puffs they haven't been doing so well. Um, but she was locked in the basement with like her sibling, and so for like a month, because like the owners of a house they completely like ignored her. Um. So yeah, even like after like the seller or like the renter told them that that um shit that there's a cat down there and so they never even bothered to, you know, to feed her. Um and that was just kind of that. Like they never bothered to feed her and so she was down there for like a month. She was like clawing at the door so her claws were in like pretty bad shape. 
and um like someone ended up buying yeah yeah it, it was someone that was renting it and then the house got sold and then they found that there was a cat down there so we get a reverse hollow carvana don't worry i'll get back to the story oh let's go let's go what do we got bang <laughs> we get a dreadnought v max that is nice all right there we go look at that oh oh he looks fat turtle <laughs> fat turtle Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Pack of sleep is just fell on her head. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my gosh. Out of the excitement, Dreadnought VMAX use a uh, solid shell. <laughs> no use headbutt to knock off the sleeves. But there we go. We already get it. We, we already start off with the VMAX. I'll let you guys appreciate that guy for a little bit longer. But as I was saying, going back to the story, um, yeah, she was she was abandoned that way, and so she has a little bit of like separation, like you know, like issues, like if she knows there's people around and like the door is like locked, then she will like start freaking out, or like if the door's closed and everything, then she'll like start freaking out. Here's another code card for y'all. Y'all guys deserve it. You guys deserve this. Like I said, going to go for that. 15, 15 subs. And to answer the question about the Charizard 10, like I said, that one is a really, I don't know. We got a stinging bee drill, a great ball, a Sonya, a Trubbish, Roly Coley. Galear and Zigzagoon. It's the same cards over and over. Weedle. Purloin. Ooh. Ooh. I like that. Ooh. You guys might be able to see, like, my reflection. Like, my blur. My blurriness. But look at that. Ooh. Ooh, that's nice. That is a very nice. And, oh, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, yeah. We get a Dreadnought V to go along with our Dreadnought V Max. That is nice right there look at that oh my gosh look at him look at him powerful bite oh my god that card's beautiful the card's beautiful we are two for two. Oh, that is oh my gosh just the color scheme in like the background like we go from like whirlpool and like stuff but look at that you start off with such a peaceful turtle and then he goes into such an angry turtle Oh no. So is is that it? Is that it? Did our good luck end? Well I want the Gardevoir. I honestly want the Gardevoir V Max. I, I think I pulled out a Gardevoir V last time I opened up Champions Path. But if I could get a Gardevoir V Max uh, Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That'll be solid. Next Champions Path pack. Everyone, pack number four. Putting emphasis on the word pack. <laughs> Don't know what I'm doing. So he's going to start off with a fire energy. Followed by a light perk. I never liked this Pokemon at all. Followed by Sharpedo. No, an amazing Pokemon in my opinion. Love the thing. We need more shark-based Pokemons. <laughs> I'm just going to put that one to the side. I like that. We got Hyper Potion. Got uh, a Detective Rock Ruff. Contact me, International Pokemon. If that's going to be a movie, I we'll have Vulpix. We get, a, we get a Galarian Lanoon. looking all mean and disgusting. Full heal. Purloin. Get a Roly Coley. Or the Dot Family. And then we get Galarian. Obstin Goose, I believe is what it's called. See, now, what upsets me, though, like, about, like, this, uh, about, like, Zigzagoon's evolutionary line is they give, you know, like, I get it giving, giving like, Galarian form and, like, giving them, like, an evolution, but, like, if you're going to do that, then give the regular one at least uh, an evolution. Like, you, like, don't even, like, it doesn't even have to be creative. It can just be some bogus-looking thing. Oh, this is our, our pile of trash hollows. Technically not even trash hollows. But you know what? Since we got 
God, the Gardevoir pack's gonna be for last, guys. These packs smell. Oh, they, they smell weird. <laughs> they smell like rubber. Probably because of the play map. But let's see, what year were these? So blurry. Twenty, yeah, twenty twenty. All right, so twenty twenty. Get that nice twenty twenty champions path. First print run, I think, of this set. Of, like, this box set. Oh. That one's for you, uh, Sam. Team Samurai X. That one's for you, bud. Probably don't even watch my videos, but still. Oh, just smelling the cars. <laughs> oh, jeez. Let me stop. And let's continue with our hunt. For the psychic energy. Look at that. It's showing us. It's showing us the way of that guard of war. We got a Milo. Why am I holding the cards like this? I don't know. A turf field stadium. Victini. Kakuna. A Pokeball. Machop. I don't know your name. A full heel. A hop. Oh. That's the third Zygarde. That is the third Zygarde I have found in this damn box. How popular is Zygarde? Tell me. Tell me. Tell me, guys. How popular is Zygarde? Who even likes Zygarde? I personally don't like Zygarde. And then Perfect Zygarde? I don't know. I feel like he's, like, too much. Like, I feel like... Like, I don't know why I'm saying that, but, like, I just feel like Perfect Zygarde. He's a little bit too much. Just a smidge. Let's look at that. Three Zygarde's. Anybody else can flex as hard as I can right now? Look at this. Look at this. Let me know. You guys got three, three hollow Zygarde's? No. No. You guys don't. Y'all are amazing for not having three Zygarde's. All right. Should we take a whiff at it? Probably not because it's probably going to give us a Zygarde. You know what? Screw it. Ah. So that one smelled like fresh shoes. Look at that. That's like, tell me that is not the neatest pack opening ever. We might set that aside. We'll go ahead and set that aside. You know, have a nice little champion's path code. Dramatic pause. One, two, three, four. Turn me around. Turf field, Malamar, Rotom phone, and lightning energy. This will be the card of power. And then we're going to go with Silizapede. Well, you nick it. I hate this Pokemon too. I don't, I don't like you nick it. Inke. 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 <laughs> Roly Coley. And then we get a Reverse Foil Beedrill. <sighs> Are we done getting our hits? We better not be. Heart of the Cards. Guide me to a Sense of Scorch. Yay. Wow, man, look at this first 30 minute long video, maybe. Should we go really fast in the last pack? Um, that sounds like a no from the cat, so I'm gonna go with no. Do you have the heart of a champion? Well, we'll see you with, oh, this. Final pack of destiny. There it is. No, where were these packs arrayed right here? Let's find out. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab my neat one over here. No, no, these packs were clean. They were clean. Look at that. That's how I waste some time. <laughs> Terrible. Oh, well, I'm... you guys didn't see it, but I did. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Oh, geez. You know what? Do you guys even care about the comments? Let's just got ugly. 
good. I don't know, might be decent in TCG game. Nice. All right, that's like our fourth psychic energy. Eh, beautiful art. Machop, another Roly Coley. God damn, these are like the exact same comments. Carvana, beautiful looking art. Another Machop. And we end off with a Fluffle, an Alteria. But yeah, so that will be, we just got two hits. Two hits and hollows, which I get, which I beg these hollows are guaranteed, right? Guaranteed a hollow at least, maybe. But we ended off with a Dreadnought and a Dreadnought VMAX. Two hits, you know, can't complain about that. Maybe out of eight packs, not the best ratios. That's a one out of every four packs. Um. But yeah, no, for sure, um, like I said, I will definitely be posting, there definitely will be like another video, maybe sometime this week, but if you guys did get through this video, oh, I just shook the camera, my bad, but if you guys did get through this video, go ahead and leave a like, comment, sub, you know, just let me know how your day is going, let me know what you'd like to see on the channel, or at least let me know if you'd be interested in Yu-Gi-Oh! or other like TCGs being opened up on the channel, um, I'll go ahead and see you guys later, peace.